pink fairy, pink fairy, one, two, three. Come on, let's get fancy, fancy. Pink fairy, pink fairy, pink fairy, shop with me. Let's go to Target, Walmart, Aldi. How's everyone doing? Pink fairy, pink fairy, one, two, three. Come on, let's get fancy. How you doing? It's Pink Fairy here. Yeah, you already knew that. <laughs> so, it's afternoon. So, I didn't get to start recording this morning. I guess you know that if it's afternoon, huh? <laughs> um, It's sunny outside. It's only 28, though, but it's sunny out. So, it's still freezing cold with the sun out. So, what are you guys doing today? So tonight for dinner, I'm making some Italian chicken because it's our fave. That and breaded, but I just didn't feel like breading it tonight. With a Southwest blend salad and some mashed potatoes. Yes, I'm allowing myself some mashed potatoes. Just a, a small amount though. Because um, I'm not like completely cutting out anything. And I'm not looking at this as a diet. I'm looking at this like a, you know, like a lifestyle change. Because I wanted to do it forever. Um, but I'm definitely eliminating bread. I haven't had bread for two days, so. Doing good. Because I know I can live without bread. I've did it before in the past. For a long time, actually. Not no bread. So that's my plan. Um, don't want to mention in the comments about walking. Yeah, I do. I do walking. I don't record it, but I do walking. I have been doing walking. Of course, I get a lot, lot more activity when it's nice outside and warm outside. Um, I'll get a whole lot more activity, especially when we get ready to open the pool. Oh, yeah. I think that's what helped me lost the weight that I didn't lose. Is, um, you know, being outside swimming, it was, you know, nice. Very nice. I was trying to think. Somebody in the comments addressing other YouTubers and how they're good, doing good, and losing weight. I know. Congrats to them. That is awesome. Totally awesome for them. But we're all different. We're not the same. Totally not the same at all. Um, we're going to do things our own way. Lose weight our own way. Get healthy our own way, I should say. So it doesn't matter, but I want to thank you all so very much for all your support yesterday. It was so, so, so kind of you guys. I got so much for support in the comments. I was like overwhelmed. I was like, oh my God, this is so awesome. Thank you guys so very much. I love you guys so much. It was very awesome to hear you guys' um, comments. Um, it gives you the, you know, give someone encour encouragement. Um, there wasn't, but, you know, a couple comments like what I just said you know I just whatever and deleted them it don't matter you know can't please everybody never is not gonna be happy for you in the world so it's like you either like me you don't or support me or you don't it don't matter you know like I said you could compare me to whoever you want I don't care it don't it's not you know really gonna face me you know everybody's different you know but that's how I'm gonna do my um lifestyle change you know what I mean and like I said no this is not a weight loss channel but I will show you my food and I will say um from time to time how I'm doing if I want you know what I mean but it's not strictly on weight like now I'm going to show you guys my Italian chicken I've probably showed a million times dumped it on there so I might not show it because I have showed you guys quite a bit just dumped it to dry Italian on there put a little bit of water in there cover it in the foil put it in the oven Turns out good and moist, and I love it. I might show you guys outside, but it is cold out there. The sun will fool you. Makes it thinks it feels warm, but it's not. So I have not had no lunch yet. This morning I had um, egg with a slice of cheese and a light yogurt. That's what I had. Drinking some water. It's not fancy, but it's still water. I like this cup because it's big. See how big it is? 
That's why I like it. <laughs> and a whole lot bigger and fancy is. I need to get a big one like this that says fancy on there. I'll probably take a marker and just write fancy on there, eh? I could do that, yeah. It'd be in black. So it'd be kind of like the same, but kind of not, you know what I mean? So yeah, oh yeah, some people ask add it on my fitness pal. Right now, I'm not really comfortable adding people on there. Um, or I don't have no friends on there right now. I used to too back in the day because I've had my fitness pal for a long time. I had a um, ton of people on there, but I've gotten rid of everybody. Um, and it's just me, and I'm just using it just for just to keep track of my you know my calories. That's it. And the bar scanning the barcode thing on there worked perfect. I did it this morning with the yogurt. Scanned it right up, and it's the right kind and everything. It was, it, you know, it was the right. It said what it was and all that. So I was really, I was like, yay. I haven't used my fitness pound in a long time. So back when I first started getting it, it was, um, they didn't have the barcode thing and all that. You had to hand type everything in. But it does save the food that you do. So it, it save the eggs that you put in. So if you want, you know, eat it more than once, which I eat a lot of eggs. Usually that's mainly what my breakfast consists of is eggs in the morning. Um, if I have breakfast, I'm hungry, but most of the times I am because I try not to eat after dinner at night. So try not to, anyways. Here lately, I've been doing pretty good not eating after dinner, but sometimes, yeah, no. Because I have a really light lunch. That's probably what I'm going to do again today. Probably going to do some turkey roll up. More than likely, that's probably what I'll do. But I got to get dinner on early because we got some things to do this evening. I do, so I'll be not home around dinner time. So I'll go ahead and get it done. And then we can just make a plate and reheat it before we leave or when we get home. One of the two. I don't know yet. We'll figure it out. But I have my last salad kit in there, that Southwest. So that's good. I was trying to think of some of the other comments. That people were asking. I oh, have yeah, a couple people said something about, oh, what's wrong, Chris? Well, I hope you're okay. You don't seem yourself. I was just perfectly fine yesterday. I was just, you know, trying to talk to you guys more on a serious note. Um, and I was perfectly fine. I was awesome, actually. Um, it's just a little different. I said, oh, Milan, I know. I'm sorry. Um, um, um. <laughs> I'm not a professional here, so. A couple of people, or a couple of people said, oh, I love this video. It's the best one ever. You're not swaying around, looking at the cat, putting it on a cabinet. Well, I'm not a professional vlogger, you know what I mean? And I don't do things too fake. I don't just say, hey, let's go do this just to make a video. I randomly just wake up and start recording or do whatever I want. I don't, you know, I'm none of this is staged. So I ain't perfect. Like I said, you either watch me or you don't. It's strictly up to you, you know. I mean, there's some YouTubers out there I don't care to watch watch out, watch either. And there's some that I love watching and are my favorite, you know. So, I guess it's all to each their own, you know. To each their own. Fun fact about me, I love chapstick. <laughs> I put it on all the time. Well, not all the time. A couple, three times a day. Is my fave. Hmm. Another fun fact about me, I always have water in my hand. Always drinking water up until I go to bed. In fact, I was just reading a thing on Facebook about that. How they're saying it's good for your heart to help you from having a stroke or heart attack when you're sleeping at night. If you drink a glass of water before you go to bed. Good for digestion if you drink a glass of water before, 30 minutes before you eat your meal. Um, it heart, help kickstart your... Um, Organs if you drink a glass of water before right when as soon as you get up One of them was two glasses for something, but I can't remember that one. I was like, oh, okay So I guess this is gonna be a chitty chat vlog guys. I don't think I've really did a chitty chat vlog But like I said, I'm making Italian chicken and mashed potatoes in that stuff with salad So you've all seen that before I'm gonna get sign up for Pinterest. I've never been on Pinterest and Try to get some more good meal ideas before I go grocery shopping this weekend. And that way I can get the stuff. 
for it. You know what I mean? Because I think it'd be awesome. You know, to try up new things, healthier new things. I want, I like zucchini and I got a spiral cutter up there to make, you know, spiral zucchini. We used to eat that all the time a lot. So I want to get some zucchini and do something with some spiral. I used to take those uh, turkey sausages up zucchini and yellow squash and fry up with it with onion and bell pepper. I used to do that all the time. Yeah. I'm not too big on spaghetti squash. I know it's good for you and I do love spaghetti, but I'll have spaghetti. I just work it into my calories. If I go over my calories and I just can't have nothing to eat, no, nothing else to eat, I'll just have to drink a glass of water because I've tried spaghetti squash quite a bit. I don't, when I cook, last time I cooked spaghetti squash, it was like a crunchy to it and uh i just don't like that at all it just even with salsa meat in and i just i couldn't do it so i might try it again how do you guys cook yours do you guys eat spaghetti squash let me know comments below if you want how do you cook it the maybe i did it wrong i don't know i cut it in half cleaned it you know cleaned the seeds out stuck it in the oven i think i might have put some butter in it maybe and some garlic maybe I can't remember. It's been a long time since, I, since I've cooked it. So, um, yeah. Just some ideas, you know what I mean? Just some ideas. Just to help each other. That's, you know, I think it's good to get ideas from each other. I mean, that's why I do YouTube. That's why most people do YouTube. It's not because you're copying somebody or any of that. It's to give each other ideas and help each other. Sharing is caring. Oh, yeah, someone mentioned in the comments, yeah. Well, you don't like nega comments and or advice comments if someone gives you advice you call them trolls no i don't that is not what i'm talking about i'm talking about trolls that, that come on and says oh my god you're so fat oh my gosh you need to lose weight or compare me to other youtubers i just had that yesterday that lady something i can't remember her name did it yesterday to me compare me to law and um amy slayton i'm like Okay, as I said, that's awesome of them. I'm so happy for them. I watched Thousand Pound Sisters and I, I've i been watching Amy and Tammy for years, you know what I mean? And uh, Thousand Pound Sisters was awesome. I love that show. I hope and pray they have a season two, you know what I mean? I hope. So, no, I don't delete the advice ones. If you're going to be downright mean to me, like, you know, some lady... Told me about the walking and stuff. You know what I mean? She's like, yeah, you need to get out walk more. Stuff like that. That's advice to me. And I left that on there. That was, That's perfectly fine. But if you're going to, you know, call me names and say, you need to live for your daughter. And don't bring my daughter into it. She has nothing to do with it. I will delete those comments. That's troll comments to me. Um, If you want to come at me and say, you know, hey, I got some advice for you. By all means. But say it in a nice way. There's a nice way and a mean way to, you know, in a mean way. If you're going to say it in a nice way, well, that's, you know, totally different. You need to go back and read my comments on some of my old videos because there's a ton of them up there. Tons of them. And some people can't say them in mean ways. And, you know, mean, mean ways. Yesterday's video, I could say I, I got lots, lots of good, good comments. And I was, yay, I was happy of that. You guys are the sweetest. I just love my friends. I love being friends with you guys. I love to be able to sit down and chat with you and talk with you. I'm not real good at doing the chit chats. I'd rather flip the camera around and record it out that way <laughs> than sitting here talking straight at you. It still makes me kind of nervous. Same way of meeting people makes me really nervous. Oh no, I guess because I've been such a homebody all my life. Pretty much all my life. I mean, I used to, when I was younger, I used to go out a lot when I am uh, with some friends <clears throat> when I was in my 20s, you know, but ever since then, it's like, I'm just, I like being at home. I love being at home, especially the way the world, I think it's more than a lot to do with the way the world is today. It's so crazy. You can't even go to Walmarts without somebody wanting to shoot up Walmarts or it's just crazy or someone in there trying to kidnap kids and women and it's like it's nuts out there isn't it yep it sure is so like i said i want to thank you all so very much for all the kind words and 
all that and let me know if you guys are making videos I love watching hauls and cooking videos and um, what you do you know your meals I also like watching vlogs too what I record is what I like watching pretty much I don't really watch much mukbangs. I do a couple few people I like or that are my favorites. I think are pretty cool. And, um, or ASMR. I don't watch no ASMR. I don't, no matter who you are, I just skip those if they do ASMRs. I just can't get into the ASMR for nothing. But anyways, I want to thank you guys all so much for watching. You guys are so, 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 so special to me. And I love being you guys' friends. And congratulations to... All the people I mentioned, the YouTubers in this video, because um, I think it's very awesome. You know what I mean? There's no no reason why we all just can't get together along. If you don't want to be a part of any other that any YouTuber, just keep to yourself. That's what I do. Cause I just I've never been a drama kind of person. You can ask anybody that knows me personally. Even in school, I was never a troublemaker. I was never a drama person. Never have been, and I do not like it. And Haley knows that. <laughs> she 100% knows that. Um, so, yeah, it's been really nice, you know. And just love one another. So, thank you, guys. I love you. Bye.